Welcome to your market update charts of the day. It's the 26th of March, 2024. Mike Smith, Senior Analyst at Go Markets, to lead you around what's happening today as we approach the midpoint of the Asian session. Overnight, there was a softer session in the US as major indices paused after hitting those record highs last Thursday. There is some significant data out towards the back end of the week, and perhaps the market is waiting for that, particularly the PCE data on Friday. US futures are near neutral in early trading today, continuing that cautious vibe. Asian markets are mixed also. The Kospi is outperforming, has hit two-year highs today in South Korea. Uh, ASX is trading near neutral, and European equity futures are pointed to a cautious open this afternoon at this stage. US dollar index also paused. Quite unusual to see the USD and the equity markets both being softer. US dollar pulled back from resistance. That pushed gold up a little bit, so it's about mid-range beneath those record highs. Copper held over $4 and is mildly up so far today. Oil was higher and is retesting the recent resistance level at around about $83 on the WTI CFD contract. Bitcoin also was a beneficiary yesterday, pushing higher after gapping earlier in the Asian session on market open. It's up to around about the 70,000 level testing that overnight it is neutral in Asia so far today. So no evidence of follow through on that just yet. On the data front, it's a quite a busy night in the US with durable goods, consumer confidence and housing data all due. But of course, most eyes will be on the GDP and weekly jobs number on Thursday, the Q and QPCE and the major one, the US PCE data out on Friday. A couple of charts that caught our eye today. We are seeing some weakness early on, and you can see a push down in the last hour or so on the GB pound Australian dollar here towards this 193 level. Although there's a pivot at 192.83, we think should it move to that level, we'll get some more selling, uh, probably pushing us down around 40 pips to the low from yesterday's open. So I think it's one really worth keeping an eye on over the next hour or so. On the ASX, we're keeping an eye on Austral here. You can see it's pushed up to this 222 level, which it tested earlier in the month and also during February. In terms of context, if we put it on a weekly chart, there looks to be a reasonable amount of upside on this. So a push through this level would probably take us up somewhere in the region of this 250 area here which would be a substantial gain on where we are now. So let's say there was a potential entry at 224. That would be a 10% return on investment should it get up there. It's one that merits some patience and also making sure that we have breached that level on the chart to confirm that breakthrough, this resistance level. Trade safe and see you again soon. Bye-bye for now.